Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you everything that I got for Christmas um, along with I showed a little montage of kind of Christmas morning. I took a little bit of footage of the tree and everything. So um, the first thing I'm going to show is this new lens that I got because I want to switch it out because it's really nice and I'm excited to use it. So the lens that my camera is filming on now, the autofocus is broken so it's kind of a pain to use. But this one has autofocus, thankfully, so I'm going to switch it out and then I'll show you the rest of the stuff. The first gift of Christmas was a mattress that we're going to cut in half so that my brother and I both have new mattresses in our beds in the camper because the ones that are there before, um, they are not very comfortable at all. So I'm excited for that so that we'll be able to sleep well when we're camping. The next thing was um, LED lights that my brother programmed and he actually wrapped them around the Christmas tree which I'll show you some pictures and video of. It looks really, really cool. But those are going to go around the top of my room um, because now I'll have a dressable but also they'll go all the way around my room because I only had them around half of my room before. So I'm very excited to do that when we get home. Um, now I'll move on to kind of like food items that I got in my stocking. I got a whole bunch of like Junior Mints and York Peppermint Patties also, which I'll be eating on our way to Florida, which we're leaving, I think, mid next week. So it'll be nice to have all of these snacks. Also, two Toblerone bars and a Lint milk chocolate um, Santa figure. In my stocking, I also got this mini puzzle, which is going to be interesting because it's 500 pieces in this teeny little box. So I don't know how that's going to work, but it should be fun. Also, two um, mystery Harry Potter characters, which will go along with my Harry Potter advent calendar that I had this past month, and earplugs. Also, I got two of my favorite deodorant. I'll move on to clothes next. So I got... This athletic shirt from my grandmother, it's like a sun shirt, but it'll also, I feel like it'll be kind of warm too. It's really soft and it's kind of this like blue stripey, I don't even know how to describe this. Also, she gave me this polka dot sundress. It's really cute, it's like a mini dress and I think you put it over a bathing suit. So I'm excited to try this on too. I haven't tried on any of this except one of the next things I'm going to show you. Um, I also got this cropped guess polo. I have been looking at this for months and I saved it um, on my Instagram a lot and it went on sale so I was like okay I'll ask for it for Christmas and I'm very glad that I got it because it is just as cute as I imagined so I'm very excited to wear this. I also got some gaiters for hiking because we've tried many times to get ones that will actually fit our boots and it seems like these will so they'll keep my boots dry when we're hiking. I also got this new winter jacket that I picked out. It's like this deep purple color. It's from Columbia. It's really warm. I've tried it on a few times and I'm very excited to go skiing with this because my last ski jacket, the sleeves are too short for me now. This next one is kind of interesting. So I started this sewing project like five years ago I think and I never finished it um, and it was kind of just sitting in our sewing station so my mom finished it for me it's this little patchwork backpack with these braided straps and it's all out of like fabric scraps so some of my favorite fabrics and on the inside it's like this watercolor thing so I think we'll probably just put a flap over it and it's like a drawstring at the top so I think it'll be cute for like knitting supplies or like I don't know books or something so We'll see, but I think it's really nice that it's finished because I probably would never have finished it. <laughs> Next, I got this book called What Color Is Your Parachute? Um, it says discover yourself, design your future, and plan for your dream job. So it's basically just like preparing yourself for life skills, setting up your goals and stuff. I don't exactly know. I haven't read it yet, but that's what it sounds like from the cover. So that should be helpful. I also got the Hogwarts Library. Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, Quidditch Through the Ages, and The Tales of Beetle and the Bard. So I have never read this before, any of these actually. Actually, I think I read a little bit of Fantastic Beasts, but never finished them. So I'm very glad to have this so I can read those. I also got next year's bullet journal from Archer and Olive. It is really cute. I will be probably doing a bullet journal setup video. 
So it is 160 pages, um, 160 GSM, ultra thick paper. It's this little swallow in gold foil. You can't really see it. The cover is like fabric-y. It's kind of an interesting texture for a notebook, but I really like it. So I'm very excited to start my bullet journal for 2021. I also got this puzzle. It's really cute. I love the cozy vibe. It's like somebody reading, having hot cocoa with their cat. Um, there's another cat and fire and it just looks really homey. So I'm excited to do this. I really like Ravensburger puzzles because they're really good quality um, and they're, they're just fun to put together. So this should be fun and it's 500 pieces. One of my favorite things that I've been asking for for a while and trying to pick the right one is here's my new guitar that I got in October, but ooh, that did not sound good. Oh, no, it's good. It is this guitar strap and it's leather and it has these little birds stamped into it and I am obsessed with this. So now I can play standing up. Ta-da. <laughs> I really like it, so I'm very glad I got this so now I can play without having to have a solid chair. My brother gave me these really cute stickers from a trip that he went on out west, so I'll probably be putting these on my bullet journal or water bottle or something. They'll go along well with my sticker collection. I also got new sheets for my bed. I picked these out in the store and they just feel really soft, so I'm excited to put these on my bed. I got a little certificate to um, promise that my parents will buy me a subscription to my music service for my videos, so how I get my music licensing. Um, it expires in April, so they'll just buy the next year of it, so that's very nice. I also got this live streaming webcam. I'm very excited to use this for school meetings so that I'll be able to look at my upper screens and not only look at my laptop, which is what I normally have to do. It should be much nicer quality than my webcam on my laptop also. I also got this ring light, which I'm currently using, so I will show you guys a picture of it or something. But it came in this really nice case, so I don't think I would like travel with it necessarily but it'll at least be safe like getting home or I don't know if I have to move it from room to room <laughs> or something but it has really nice lighting as you can see and the last thing that I got which I'm super excited about and I have to film an unboxing video before I can play with it which really annoys me but I, I do want to show you guys it um, my first impressions but I got the DJI Mavic Mini 2 I am so excited to film with this. I think it'll be really fun to film like on the beach and in the mountains, places like that that you kind of might want to see an aerial view of. So I'm very excited. I've only ever flown small drones. I mean, this is pretty small, but it's bigger than I've ever flown and much more expensive. So I definitely need to learn how to fly it before I actually take it off. So I will not be flying it today, but I will definitely be using the simulation. So make sure to check out the um, unboxing video for this when it's out. I have no idea when I'll actually have learned to be able to fly this safely, so I don't know when to expect that video, but I'm very, very excited to fly this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that I got for Christmas. I'm very grateful for all of these gifts. Thank you to everybody who gave me these. Um, I hope you had a happy holidays. Um, make sure to follow me on all social media at Rosie Revolts and um, on my Etsy shop, also at Rosie Revolts, and check out my book at getoutdoorsbook.com, and I will see you guys later. Bye!